of a local chef who you've seen here on Portland Day celebrating a huge win. Joshua McFadden won a James Beard Award for his best selling cookbook. It's called Six Seasons A New Way With Vegetables. He's back from the awards in New York and Mackenzie Roth caught up with him at his Southeast Portland restaurant, Ava Jeans. So we're here at Ava Jeans with James Beard Award winning chef Joshua McFadden. He's fresh from New York City where he just won a very prestigious award we're going to get into. Thanks so much for being with us. Thank you. I don't know how fresh. I'm a little tired. But <laughs> you super fresh. <laughs> All right, so here's your beautiful cookbook. And I mean, it's just such a simple, beautiful cover. Six Seasons. A new way with vegetables, and this is all the buzz. So let's first let's start talk about the book, about your cookbook. Oh, um, it took a long time to make, and uh, the whole idea of Six Seasons, first of all, was to kind of create a conversation around when to not buy things. Right. Um, I mean, we all know that there's four. Kind of just put a little bit of finesse on there and kind of created these little micro moments. Okay. Uh, for when people can start paying attention. Right. And most importantly, again, when to not buy stuff. When to um, not buy stuff. Why do you think people don't like vegetables in particular? Think, Why do you think it's tough to eat them? I, I don't have that problem. I don't know. We sell so many vegetables at this restaurant at right. and, and at Tusk. Um, so I'm not around that very often. I mean, like. Uh, well, you make know. them delicious. We That's why. Delicious. Well, so, I talk about it in the book how I try and make them taste like potato chips. So that probably helps. Yes, yeah. absolutely. And I have an eight-year-old, so that is key. Either put stuff in a smoothie or make them taste like potato chips. Yeah. So exactly. tell us about your experience in New York City, where you you won a James Beard Award, um, and this is incredible. It is incredible. Um, well, I lived in New York for a long time, so it was really fun to go out, and a lot of my friends were at the ceremony for winning other things. Yeah. And then went out and had dinner, and it was, uh, and then it was on the news really early in the morning, which is funny. Um, so I really haven't really processed it. That it's happening. But any of imagination, it's like back to work and back taking care of employees and buying vegetables in spring. Yes. Um, so it hasn't really, I haven't. I mean, I'm honored. You should be. Uh, and it blows my mind. Uh, this is incredible. What do you think it is about this cookbook that's unique and that earned you that award? I think um, it's about people. You know? Yeah. It's like that whole book was. The whole thing was was created to kind of teach people how to cook and not tell people. How to cook. There's there's so many books that I have that just are always like telling me what to do and it's, I'm absorbing that in a different way and it's put other people in a position of how to cook and how to do things and the questions that are often asked when the people come to this restaurant is why what is this what is this and what is this and often it's like breadcrumbs or just the right vinegar or salt. And it's as simple as that. It's simple May, you know, that. May first is tomorrow. What are some key vegetables that we should be cooking with right now this uh, season? Asparagus is going. Okay. Uh, snap peas, I think, are right around the corner. This should be. Okay. Uh, peas coming up, and then all those will be like a flurry for a while. All these great. Mushrooms coming in, lots of great beans, rhubarb, all kinds of fun stuff. And you can find all those here at Eva Jeans. And tell us really quickly about Mother's Day. I know you have a big brunch. We have a coming. really cool brunch coming up. Yeah, yeah it's really fun. We, um, I love brunch food, and I, I love so. uh, this being an Italian restaurant. That's not really something that they typically do, so it's fun for me to kind of play with that. So I have like carbonara for breakfast and cappuccinos and really fun, just different pastries and lots of different vegetables and stuff for breakfast. Yeah, reservations still available? Reservations are still available. All right, Chef, thank you so yeah, much. You and so much. Midwest love, we're both from the Midwest, <laughs> bringing it out here to PDX. Thank you so much. Back to you. Obviously, Mackenzie caught up with Joshua a few days ago. She realizes yes. today is May 2nd. But the vegetables <laughs> are still delicious <laughs> yes, any day. Yes, no matter what day of the month. And you can find Joshua's book at his restaurant there on Southeast Division, Ava Jeans. Hey, come